Tom Peeble, øh, der er sådan noget der. Tolerate the most kind, the most uh, pain, or oh, the pain tolerance is not that high, so if we start with a light touch, then uh, that we should be fine. And if I hurt you in any way, then just tell me, then I'm gonna massage you like. some of these as we always saw in the movies so we've got some muscles in the back that's called the ability spin spinning And that is just those long muscles of the of the back in each side. They are quite nice to get a good massage, also a strong massage. So that's the ones I'm looking at now. Is it okay? Nice. Remember, it should not be painful at all. So if it's gonna, if it hurts, then just tell me why. And 
now we're just stretching out the fibers, stretching out the fascia. It's really nice when you get the, on the skin and just stretches the skin because the fascia is gonna get a lot of work there. The fascia can be very tight and sometimes it's not always the, the muscles that is restricted. It can very well be the fascia around the muscle. The fascia is just uh, letting the muscles climb together and it's actually holding the muscles in place. So it, it has a vital role in our body. So we should not neglect that. And I'm very sorry if my muscle uh, and body talk is uh, boring you. <laughs> I'm just very interested in this kind of uh, in these kind of subjects, so uh, I like to tell about it. circular motions and I'm going deeper and deeper on this muscle knot yeah, if you can feel it travels down your leg yeah yeah it can be because we are on the sciatic nerve then it feels like it travels down the leg and uh, sometimes all the way down to the foot And we're holding a stretch in the fashion. Mm. And release. Stretching the fashion.
so now I'm just gonna do the same thing over here just so we can get I know it's not always the same tolerance in the same side so on this side you might feel it's uh, gonna be a little bit easier on the pain or oh, the pain is uh, not that bad um, but we shall see so I'm just gonna do almost exactly the same but uh, yeah it's not always exactly the same I can maybe feel some more tightness or some more muscle, muscle knots so we shall see just some strokes I'm not gonna do the light strokes so much this time because you are used to my touch now yeah it's just the nervous system it's gonna be a little bit easier on this side It's okay. Nice. And I will do some on the other side of the muscle. Hmm? So does it feel different on this side? It doesn't. Okay, that's good. So are you good at drinking water? You are. Okay, I'm glad to hear that. Hmm? Yeah, especially today it's uh, good to drink a lot of water. They say it's just to flush those toxins out, but uh, yeah, the evidence on that is not uh, very, very good. So I'm not saying to anyone that it's because of the toxins. But uh, something is happening to the body when you get a massage because yeah, some people can even pee more. Yeah, they can pee darker after getting a massage. Or yeah, they can get lightheaded. I also think it's because we are just uh, pushing the blood up towards the brain. Then you get on lightheaded, and of course we are pushing it towards the heart. But we are pushing a lot of blood up here, so I think it's something to do with that. Just my thoughts. And some people always also get a running nose when getting massage. Um, but it actually doesn't happen in uh, chair massages so often. It's mostly because people are face down, and uh, when you face down, you get a lot of air up in your uh, nostrils, and uh, your nostrils just trying to uh, uh, get wet because they don't want to be that dry. Um, so it's not so much the massage but more on the way you are sleeping with your head down and getting a lot of air out there and we are stretching the fascia stretching the fascia stretch 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 Okay, I feel a muscle knot here, so I'm just gonna use my elbow. 
And on the Eurytus Benin, on the Eurytus, on the Eurytus. On the Eurytus Benin, on the Eurytus Benin, on the Eurytus Benin, on the Eurytus Benin. And a little bit on the glutes. A little bit on the glutes. Stretch, 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 stretch. Stretch, 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 stretch. Stretch, 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 stretch. Stretch, 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 stretch. Stretch, stretch, stretch. Stretch, stretch, stretch. Stretch, stretch, stretch. Yeah, and uh, here on the rhomboids area, just behind the, the shoulder blades, can be quite painful in the upper area so that's just two spots I can press on and you might feel it up in yeah someone can feel it just underneath the shoulder blades and someone can feel it um, up in the neck and it's just because the trapezius also goes down here so maybe it's the trapezius press press hmm. and release and I'm just doing a one through here actually it for this time and it was just a pure back, back massage so next time I would actually like to get some uh, neck in there as well um, especially for your headache it can really those uh, tight muscles in the neck and they attaches up here so I really want to do something to those as well but uh, yeah, thank you so much for coming. I'm just gonna give you a glass of water before I let you go. And um, if you just drink a lot of water for the rest of the day, then uh, you should be just fine. So I will give you that glass of water. Here you go. Well, okay. Thank you. Name you check that first. So um, I'm glad to see that. So uh, you should not be that badly uh, damaged today when you just uh, drink a lot of water. But um, I will see you again if we make an appointment for like two weeks. I think that should be fine because then we can just get through this a little bit faster than if you just uh, come in a month. Then you can just get back to where it was. So two weeks, then uh, we, then we should could get this uh, this pretty much uh, done in a couple of times, maybe three to four times. Hmm? So um, thank you so much, and I see you next time.